He had his first hit before I was born. He's blues legend Bobby Parker. Welcome to Next Stop. It's my pleasure, man. No, it's our pleasure. Oh. I am honored to be around. You played on Ed Sullivan, The Beatles. Let's talk about The Beatles. What happened with The Beatles? McCartney was a good friend of mine. He still is. But they, they should uh, put a little leverage on um, uh, some of the, you know, the, the songs that... Uh, you they know. stole your riff, man. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you, I know I'm you glad know. you said it. <laughs> What's the riff? What song? Uh, I feel fine. What was it like when you heard that come out and you knew that that was yours? I was just uh, flabbergasted. I said, whoa, the Beatles like that song, man. You know, something's got to be done about that. It was good, you know, but uh, you know, they just smile and shake my hand, but... <laughs> <laughs> well, they should have they should put something else in your put hand. Put something in the, in the hand. So Carlos Santana. Yeah. Loves you. Eric Clapton loves you. Two of the best guitar players in the world. They love you. They love your music. That's great, man. That must, you must be honored, man. That's They're incredible. friends of mine. They're buddies of mine. I love them guys, man. What are they like? Um, I, I was with Carlos. Uh, uh, influences to me a lot. And uh, I'm so happy that he went on up through the clouds. You know, he got 12 or 15 Grammys. We did a lot of shows together, and uh, we played all over the world. You've seen so many things in your decades of performing. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm just honored to be on the stage with you right now, honestly. But what's, what's the best memory for you? Um, the Apollo days uh, with uh, uh, all the original artists. I mean, uh, uh, the... the uh, uh, Original blues artists like Bo Diddley, uh, uh, Lil Anthony, the Imperials, uh, Frankie Lyman, uh, Frankie Avalon. Uh, 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 so many guys, I can hardly remember, but you know, the, the, those guys. Annette Funicello, you know, she was a big star. In oh, things. yeah, she was yeah. Mickey Mouse Club. And uh, Fabian, uh, I remember him, and uh, just so many people. You know? So, how do you keep it going? I mean, here we are. I'm not going to tell your age. We discussed this. <laughs> but you're still bringing it. Your first hit hey, before I was born. How do you keep relevant? How do you keep the energy? I love the music, man, and people make me happy out there. Let me hear you say, yeah! Yeah! We love it, man. We love it. So we love what's, the music. what's next for you? Uh, we got a new album coming out, and um, we traveling the world and doing the same thing we always did. Did you know? We love it. How do you like playing this room? This is a very cool venue. Let me tell you something. This guy is my best buddy, Bill Duggan. Let's, let's, let's bring him up here. He's I best, have Bill. That's my best buddy in the world. <laughs> He's, he opened this club with you. Oh, we, we is, opened it together 20 years ago. A great celebration. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> To Bobby Parker. Wow. Hey, to Bobby Parker, Get still bringing it here. <laughs> I met Bill Duggan at uh, Mick Fleetwood's club in Alexandria, Virginia. And he said, man, I don't have a club yet, but I'm going to get a place. Would you play with me? I say, you get the joint, man, we'll hang together. So what's your message to all the young musicians out there who would aspire to maybe play for 10 years? What's, what have you learned? What's the secret? Never give up. Stay with it. Never give up. It's a great message, Bobby Parker. Oh, Honored you. to have you. It's my pleasure. Thank you very much. <laughs>